Welcome to the Creative Hugza. In today's tutorial, we'll create a letter portrait text effect in Affinity Photo. Go to File, New, and Create a New Document. Give it the following properties. Grab the Artistic Text tool. Click on the document and type the letter N or whatever letter you want to use. Make sure the letter is large. Go to the font family and select the Stude Baker NF Bold font. Go to File, Place, and select the picture of the woman. Hold Shift while you drag the picture onto the document. Go to the Tools panel and grab the Selection Brush tool. Select the woman until all of her is selected. Make sure in the context toolbar that you're in the add mode to select the woman. Also check the snap to edges box. In the context toolbar, after selecting all of the woman, hit refine. When the refine selection box appears, change the output to new layer. Hit apply. Grab the Move tool from the Tools panel. Select the woman. Place the image on the end on the right side. Turn the original image back on in the Layers panel. Select the original image and drag it inside of the text layer. Resize and arrange the image inside of the text layer so that it matches with the duplicated image. I turned the duplicated layer off so that you can get an idea of how it should be sized. Select the duplicated image and add a mask layer to it from the layers panel. With the mask layer still selected, grab the paintbrush tool. In the swatches panel, make sure the black color is active. Go to the brushes panel. Go to the basic brushes and select the 128 pixel round light brush. Make sure you're on the mask layer. Take the brush and start to conceal part of the woman. Turn off the image inside of the text layer so that you can see what is being concealed. Turn it back on when you're done. Go to File, Place. Select the other image you downloaded. Hold Shift while you're dragging it across the document. Turn the image the opposite way by going to Arrange in the top menu and select Flip Horizontal. Grab the Selection Brush tool. Make sure you're in Add Mode 
and that the snap to edges is on. Select all of the man. Hit refine in the context toolbar. When the refine selection box appears, set the output to new layer, then hit apply. In the layers panel, turn the original image back on. Then drag the image inside of the text layer. Line the pixel image up to the image inside the text layer. Add a mask layer to it from the Layers panel. Grab the Paintbrush tool. Make sure you're using the black color. In the Brushes panel, go to the Basic Brushes and choose the 64 pixel round light brush. Get rid of part of the man's legs until you get to the part where it meets the bottom of the end. You can decrease the size of the brush if you need to by pressing the left bracket on the keyboard. With the pixel layer still selected, conceal the back half of the man. You can turn the other image off in the text layer to see what is being masked. When you're done concealing the areas of the man, turn the other image back on in the Layers panel. Grab the Rectangle tool from the Tools panel and draw a rectangle that covers the whole document. Double click on the white in the Swatches panel to bring up the Color Chooser. Give the rectangle the following fill color. In the Layers panel, select the rectangle and drag it beneath all the other layers. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and comment below. Also, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.